How's it going everybody? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Glazy Gobbler. So we are back here at the base. I have done a little bit of things since last episode. As you can see, I have some milk. The primary thing I did, which I think is very important. So as you can see, first of all, I don't have cough right now. If I go in here, these guys do not have cough either because I reset them. I have noticed, however, that I think the issue with this village is that when nomads come in, they bring the cough with them. Like if they get attacked or whatever on their way in, or if they walk by anything, they get they get cough. So there's a couple things I want to show you guys that I've done off camera. <laughs> off camera, that's such a funny term. Anyways, yeah, check this out, guys. So first thing I've done is I've put a cow station here. I've put one here. Already harvested a ton of milk. As you can see, these guys are good. They don't have cough. Um, so this one here, if nomads were to come in here and if they have cough, they walk through here, they go straight to the base. I don't think they infect these cows, which is great. And I also have another cow station. I put two. So it did take me a while to get these cows, but I think it was worth it. And there's something on the right there, but I'm going to show you guys that in a second. I just want to show you guys the cows. Uh, the cow stations um i had a, a few people suggest it like it's been it's been an idea for a while and it, it is the closest thing we have to like a decan like decontamination chamber kind of thing as of now like parasites doesn't really have any any built-in thing for that so this is all we have okay so see look these nomads are taking are taking damage so if they do make it in the base they're gonna bring they're gonna bring the cough with them which is uh, kind of lame, if you ask me. But yeah, so we also have another cow station out here. Just right over here. Two more right there with some milk. And as you guys can see, these guys are not contaminated either because I would have gotten cough if I walked next to them. So that's all good. The issue is... The nomads come in, and sometimes when they get attacked, they'll bring the cough with them. And there's no way to, because there's no way to decontaminate the nomads. They don't. I mean, I don't even know if if the regular uh, Tectopia villagers like if once you have them and they can access the chests and stuff. I don't know if they'll even drink milk. I gotta test that. I gotta test to see if the villagers will drink milk to cure the cough. That would be pretty cool. I don't think they do though. Um, but either way, the nomads definitely don't because they don't. I don't think they. Um, I don't think they look at the chest. All right. So this is the other thing I did off camera too. I'm gonna. I'm gonna show you guys this. This is pretty important. This is our graveyard. So this is a big rippers. This is for Falcon, miner of many ores, father of many clones. Uh, and we're gonna put like a pickaxe here, I'd say for him. We also put the gold down here. We have a lot of resources, so that's all good. Uh, and this is for Bethany. So, harvester of wheat, mother of our hearts. So, these are the only two that I remember their names, to be honest. If you guys remember any of the names of the other villagers that we lost, which is all the ones that we've had up till now, um, then let me know in the comments and I'll put a grave for them too. And this is for the rest. As you can tell, the rest, the unknown, the silent heroes, rest in peace. Alright guys, so we got the graveyard done. I think that's pretty important. Show respect. If we're going to start over, we can't forget about what we've done in the past. We got to move forward. We got to do better. And so that's going to be a stark reminder. As you can see, these cows are a first step in that direction. Um, but again, it's not going to be that valuable because at the end of the, at the end of the day, the nomads, if they come in, look, like, let's say one of them gets attacked out there, right? And he comes in here and he doesn't die. He doesn't die, right? He doesn't turn. He, he, he just gets hit one time and he runs away, whatever. And he comes through here and the turrets defend him or whatever. And he comes all the way up here and he goes inside. He's infected. So anybody he walks into in here, including me, including these guys, including the merchant. Let's see if the merchant's infected. No, I think I would have gotten it. Okay, so we, I think we got lucky because I've been... It did take me like a couple hours to get these cows and these guys have died. 
like like with my current setup with with me being able to replenish you know drink milk and shit these guys have died they've turned into they they, they got the cough and they turned into, into the little the little bitches so i'm really not sure what to do i really need you guys' help we need some creative solution i'm not going to um i'm not going to get more villagers and stuff until we know for a fact that we have a way to prevent any of the cough from getting in and something we can do right uh, like the obvious choice and probably the only thing we can do right now is to secure the entire area in which the nomads can spawn in which goes out all the way here let me show you where it goes out to let's see we, i don't even think we've, we've looked at this corner over here Let's check out this corner. Let's see where it is. Right here. Okay. So. Alright. Where's the corner? Right here. Okay. So it goes all the way right here. Okay. So we need to have from here to, I would guess, approximately like right here and here and here. We'd have to get this whole square cordoned off and entirely secure where there's no chance of and actually a little bit out too just to be safe like out to like here or something so i mean that is the goal to do down the line that is something i wanted to do from the start especially once i figured out like the uh or once i once i tested out the modular turrets mod i was like yeah we can totally bring this to the next level and so i'm i am gonna do this but this is gonna take a, a, a really long time. We haven't even finished the pipeline. I mean, guys, I, I didn't do anything apart from, I didn't work on the pipeline since last episode. We can go check it out. I'll show you guys where it's, where it's at. And it's also, I guess it's not really a pipeline. It's more of a, I guess technically it'd be a monorail with like a monorail with uh, energy and material transportation. Oh, wow. I messed that up, didn't I? Yeah, so, I don't know. Ooh, I hear a parasite. It's probably underground, though. Yep. Uh, it's, all right, it's further down. I'm not going to dig for it. Yeah, so, let's see. I think it's this one. Yeah, it's actually on the other side. Yeah, we'll go check that out. I I didn't really have any plan for this episode. I just wanted to ask you guys, like, what do you think? Because at this point, the in terms of um, having my villagers not turn, the danger is that the nomads bring in the cough, which I, I haven't thought about it personally. I don't know if any of you guys have thought about it about that but that is the issue right now because even if i'm good they still bring it in so that's that's what we need to solve if anybody has any ideas please let me know uh and again i'm not going to be i'm not going to uh restart the village until we have that figured out because there's no point they're just gonna they're all just gonna die i'm just gonna waste a bunch of emeralds a bunch of time i'm gonna have to place more graveyards i don't want to do that don't want my, my people to die for no reason all right so this is fine. i do have a couple hearts and I, I i do have like some emeralds left and the good news is i i still have even though all the villagers died right i still have all the uh still pretty far i haven't done any work on it but i still have all the all the buildings so we just got through the villagers that we need i'm not gonna get a rancher or anything like that i think i'm just gonna go straight for a. am just gonna get just farmers like a, at least one farmer and then a miner um actually we might not even honestly we don't even need a miner because we have so much yeah, but guys, check this out. I think I think this thing, I mean, this just looks so cool. Like, look at this. And so, I was thinking about putting another outpost uh, in between here and the base. I'll probably just put one on the, on the outskirt of the base. But for now, I'll probably, hopefully by next episode, I think I'm going to just 
you know, finish this all the way there, all the way to the base. And then at some point, maybe I'll put another outpost. Uh, ooh, that was close. But yeah, this this looks really cool, honestly. I haven't, I mean, these aren't even done. I didn't even put the barbed wire and stuff. It stops right here. But just in case, I don't know. I, I doubt there's anybody watching this as their first one, but I'll just, I'll just show you guys what I have. As you can see, I have like a little, a solid little outpost out here and my digital miner is in here. Oh yeah, let's check in on it. Let's see if it's been, cause I haven't been close to here in a long time. Let's see if it's still been gathering resources. That'd be pretty tight. Oh, I gotta go and do it this way. Alright, yeah, so you guys can see the nomads are taking damage. And one damage at a time, that's interesting, because that makes me think that it's... That makes me think that it's... The turrets. I didn't even think... Wait, what the fuck? Hold up, hang on. They're taking one damage. Okay, Vortham, he took one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven damage. Okay, so that didn't kill him. He didn't die. That's only seven. Oh no, he took damage earlier too. One, two, three, four, five, six, plus seven. Wow. Okay, that's thirteen. Ooh, that's not enough. Did he? Oh. What? Hang on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, that's 14. I don't know. I don't know, guys. These are all one damage. The thing is, one damage, that's, that sounds like they're being shot at by the turrets. Do the turrets shoot at them if they're infected? If that's the case, how come some of them are still... Yeah, okay. So, they... Okay, so in terms of this... Since we don't have a we don't have a power generation source over here, so the only power is coming from all the way. Okay, here. Let me sh here. You know what? Let's just take. Let's just take. Do I have one up here? Alright. So the only power source we have for this uh, digital miner. As you can see, it's coming from this power cable, which is all the way over here to these solar generators. So once we do connect this to the main base, it'll also have access to the solar generators in the main base, which is pretty tight. We have so many here. Okay, here, I'll just bring some back. Okay. Yeah, so this is our, our main generation source for now. Oh, Alright. It's annoying. Uh, it's also very loud. That's the, uh, that's the batteries, I think, that are making that noise. But yeah, this is where we have our, uh, three-time ore generation set up. Is this still running? Wow, it hasn't even gone through all this copper. So it probably doesn't run when we're far away, because I feel like it would have gone through it all by now. Uh, yeah, I guess we can put this away. Check this out. Look at all the resources I have. I haven't been here in a minute, so it could be... Jeez, bro. Alright, we'll just put all this copper in here. Screw it. We can't, even, we can't even handle all the resources we're getting from the... Uh, <laughs> From the, from the digital miner and it's all the way over there too like we've already mined out this entire area all right let's go back uh but yeah i i don't really know what to do right now i'm kind of in a rut um i really whoa where's my hunger bar <laughs> what the hell 
Alright, yo, I really want to get started on the, uh, on the village again, but, I mean, again, although it hasn't been shown in this video so far, I promise you guys there are issues with the, the nomads. The nomads get infected, they come in and they spread it, because since I've been putting up the cow pens in the graveyard, there's, there's been there's been infections again with, with my architect and and the other guys tradesmen or whatever so uh, I, I just don't wanna I, I don't wanna do it I'm not gonna do it until I know it's safe so I guess yeah again my my options are either to wait until uh, to wait until there's an update to escape and run and they do that but I mean that's entirely up to the developers I mean Mod developing is so, it's, it's arduous, it's tough, it takes a long time, it's very technical, you can't, you can't expect them to do something that isn't part of their original plan, like if they didn't, but I do believe that they have implement, like they, they did plan on there being some way to control it and stuff, because there's ways to control and it's not fully implemented yet, but there's there's ways to control the spreading of the parasite biome. Uh, there's like these, uh, I think they're called lures, 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 and they, they're like these blocks. There's like five levels of them, I think, and they there's supposedly they spread the the spreading of the biome. I haven't I tried it out a little bit. It didn't seem to work. I might have to do some more thorough testing, but that doesn't apply to the spreading of cough. Um. So here, let's just see, let's just see, let's check it out. I'm sure there's nomads in here. Let's see if, if anything's happened. I mean, they might not even been in here. I, I might have been too far away for them to spawn. I should check out a mod that uh, just allows for just entities to, to spawn and, and remain. At oh yeah, okay, yeah, see, look guys, see what I'm saying? Um, It's bad, and now I have cough. Good thing I have some milk. But I'm about to run out. Let's test if they have it. Hopefully they don't because they're in here. And the, yeah, so. They didn't, I mean, obviously they don't come in here. So that's a nomad. A nomad came in here. It had cough and it just expired over time. Died right here. And yeah, so that's the nomads, guys. I'm telling you. Like, it's, that's the issue. So. I can obviously like cordon off the entire fucking hole like a mile away from from this building right here in every direction that's gonna take a long time that might be the only viable option right now I, because I don't think there's anything else but guys if you guys know any other options please let me know um, that's the whole purpose of me filming this video right now is that I realize that that's the issue with the nomads and I'm I don't know what to do. So guys, please let me know and sorry for making this a quick one, but that's going to be it and I will see you next time. Guys, have a good one.